I'd like to show you a rather easy way to uh, control a servo that is used to throw a switch or a turnout on an HO or other scale uh, model railroad. You see I have a, a switch up here on a piece of foam. There's a servo mounted in the side of the foam and a little piece of uh, stiff piano wire going up into the, th the arm of the, uh, the switch. And I have one of the small uh, servo testers uh, sitting here that's connected to the servo. And you'll notice if I turn the knob on top of that controller, I can move the switch points back and forth. I've added a resistor and a switch um, to that circuit, and that's described on my web page. And if I throw the switch, you'll see the servo move. And it moves quite precisely. And that's all you really need to do is to add that resistor and switch to um, limit the distance that the uh, arm will throw uh, for your turnout. You'll notice that I have a resistor right here. It happens to be in a socket. I had it in a socket just for experimentation, but that's all you need to add is a, I used a 4.7K resistor and a single pole double throw switch. There you can see the circuit is nothing. All it is is the resistor being put into line uh, with the potentiometer and it works rather nicely. Let me do that again. To set it up, just make sure that the resistor is out of the circuit. Turn the knob until the points are on one side. In my case, it's the far side of the, uh, the turnout. I'll turn them like that. And then throw the switch, and that 4.7K resistor brings it back to the other side. If you needed to throw farther, you could insert a smaller value resistor. If you needed to travel less far, you could put in a higher value resistor. But that's all that's really necessary. I'd like to show you the modifications that were made to the circuit board to get this to operate. There's really nothing to it. There are three uh, wires, or pins rather, that come through from the, uh, serv or the uh, potentiometer on the back of the, bo the servo test board. And I've connected a black wire to the negative lead uh, on that uh, potentiometer, an orange wire to the center lead or the wiper. And that's all I bring out to the switch and resistor. Again, this is explained quite uh, clearly on my web page. You could also do the soldering on top if that's a little bit easier for you. I do have test wires on there that I soldered on to the center and the, the negative pin uh, of the potentiometer.